welcome to the city of brotherly love, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Along with Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. Ray, there was so much emphasis for years on the divisional matchups, but you really have to look at it at the conference now, like tonight. Yeah, you take, you got to take a wider picture because of the way that the playoffs are structured. The games in your conference are critical. The points that you're trying to earn are the same ones they're trying to earn. And somebody's going to get them, and those will matter in a playoff spot. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dot. The Blue Jackets start with possession as we are now underway. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Line A. Philadelphia's got control of it now from their own end. The Flyers play it along the wing. Scrum along the boards. Columbus has possession of it now. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. The Flyers ready to go on the attack. And they can't connect. Puck grab by Line A. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Pumps the puck away. They go on the attack from the left side. Levels them with the hit. The Blue Jackets gain control of the puck against the wall. Scooped up along the wall by Roslovic. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. Dishes it to Atkinson. Philadelphia is looking to break out of their own end. They've got numbers. Rocks them on the play. Puck picked up by Roslovic. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. Philadelphia's got a hold of it against the wall. The Flyers will play it from the defensive zone. Maintains possession. He was locked in there. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. Still looking for our first goal. Jenner's won it off the faceoff. From the right side, moves it up ahead. And it's a quick pass to Jenner. Columbus has the puck. Passes it over to Savard. Quick feed to Bjorkstrand. Columbus steps inside. Takes the feed. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Aaron pass and the play's broken up. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Loose puck battle along the boards. Grabs it in his own end. Strong defensive effort. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Oh, what a stop! Columbus tries to break out from their own end. Domi swooping in on the attack. Excellent stick work on the play. Nice zone entry on the left side. Oh, and down he goes on the ice. Oh, he thought there was room. Obviously, there was none. Gavrikov's lugging the puck. Gains the zone through center. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Jostled off the puck. Throws it in. The Flyers get a hold of the puck along the boards. Sends a pass over. Moves it around along the half wall. Couldn't connect on that pass. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. We'll get a look at that crushing hit again. Right along the board, he finishes right through the player. More than half the period has expired. Still scoreless in this one. Columbus has it in their own end. Moves it quickly over to Nash. And we'll get a face-off while one lucky fan gets a souvenir. Here in the late goings of the period, we've still got zeros on the board. Columbus is quick on the draw. Philadelphia's got the puck along the wall. Great heads-up play by the defender. Here's a move in tight. Stopped by the goaltender. Puck scooped up by Braun. The Flyers move to the offensive zone. 
The Blue Jackets look to start the transition game. Columbus moves it ahead. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Into the attacking area from the left side. Rocks him against the board. That's a great hit. I love the way that he took the ice away and slammed him into the wall. Good hit to knock the puck loose. Del Sato stick handling in his own zone. Roslovic's got it in the offensive end. Stays with it. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Costas Bear's got it in the defensive end. He's got a step, and he hangs on just as time runs out. There's the horn bringing period number one to an end. Still no score in this one. When your team wins, you win $10 off at Bombs. Bring tonight's ticket to any local Bombs Sporting Goods for a coupon that's good for $10 off your next purchase. Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. The middle stanza is about to go. The official's ready to drop the puck. Still no score in this one. We'll see if period number two finds ourselves a goal. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Philadelphia's pace of play is something they'll be really happy with. They've had the puck most of the time. They just haven't been able to break through yet. Turn that chance aside. And now it's over to Provorov. Picked up along the boards by Konechny. And now it's grabbed by Wierenski. Here's a short pass to Roslovic. Along the right side into the offensive zone. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And he denied that opportunity. Works it across to Roslovic. Moves it to the offensive zone. All smart heads up play to poke that one away. Couldn't make that one happen. Pokes the puck away. The Blue Jackets have it against the wall. And he regains control of the puck. Quick pass to Roslovic. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Lowers the boom with that hit. Denies him. He got all of it. Tosses it on to Line. Columbus is on the attack. And he takes a shot. And he comes up with it. Philadelphia's gained possession along the boards. Slides the puck over. Rocked him in the open ice. His reflexes on display tonight. Keeps hold of the puck. The Blue Jackets take it along the wing. A shot gets in front of it. Hart's in great position here to make this stop. Nice work by the goaltender. Still lots of time left in the period. Still no score in this one. Columbus takes possession off the face. Oh, he scores! The defensive team can't get control of the puck off this face up. It ends up into the shooter's hands, and he beats the goaltender. Columbus finds a way to wiggle out in front. Yeah, this has been such a closely contested game. Finally, they get a lead here in the second period. Dishes it to Bjorkstrand. Looks to pass it to Jenner. Philadelphia's got the puck here in the open ice. Up along the wall on the right side and into the attacking area. Oh, he'll feel that one. Moves with the puck at the corner. Nice pass. Rocks him. Moves it to Domi. The Blue Jackets move it ahead. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. With possession along the wall. Bringing the physicality tonight. And he makes the save. Columbus has it near the wall. Taken along the wall by Van Riemsdyk. 
and pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Takes the feed from the left side. Pokes it away in his own end. The Flyers gain possession along the wall. From center, they get into the attacking area. To the front! Stopped by the goaltender. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Philadelphia's got the puck along the boards. Couldn't complete the play. Feeds the puck over to Patrick. Philadelphia's in now. Forces the turnover. Columbus gets a hold of it. Gains the zone from the right. Philadelphia's got a hold of it along the wall. Nice connection on a cross-ice pass. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. On the attack along the boards. Big save. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. Into the middle of the neutral zone. From the slot, wrist shot, he scores! Now you gotta keep clawing back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. He kept moving in that high slot, looking for an area that might be open. Then the puck's on and off his stick. Nice shot. Philadelphia's equalizer comes at a critical time of the game, late in the period, isn't it, Ray? Anytime you give up a goal late in the period, you feel like you've given up more than that. So this is a critical goal. Well, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. There's the whistle. Penalty coming up. The Flyers are going to be shorthanded because of a tripping call. Played with fire. He got burned, Ray. Oh, he's digging around for the pocket. Sometimes you just get caught. This time the player goes down and he's got to go to the box. Columbus sends their man advantage unit out for the first time this evening. You can set a special team trend if your first power play is a positive one. Get some shots, get some pressure. And they'll get it out of the defensive end. Angles it over to Atkinson. Columbus plays it along the wing. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Gets it out of his own end. Columbus gains a hold of the puck against the boards. Now he takes it over the line. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Period comes to an end, and lucky us, we've got one more period to go in what has been a fun one this evening. Third period just around the corner. Ray and I will be ready to bring all the action in moments. possession. Quick feed to Domi. Can't find his man. Whiffs on that. Carries it across the line. Wrists one. Stones him with the blocker. And the man advantage unit comes up empty-handed. We keep things deadlocked with both teams back at even strength. Now the pressure ramped up on the penalty kill there as they go into that last power play tied. They do a really nice job. They keep the game knotted as the power play wasn't able to cash in. Roslovic's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Stopped by the goaltender. Now, by being in the right position, James, he gets so tight to the shooter, there's nowhere for the puck to go. Moves it quickly over to Hayes. The Flyers will play it against the wall. Puts it up front, takes a wrist shot, he scores! Well, this could be something that changes your year around. You get a few bounces like this, or you don't get a few bounces like this. The puck's off the post in the net. 
I don't think the goaltender gets a look at this at all, James. He just drops into the butterfly. He's hoping the thing hits him through that trap. Philadelphia's got the one goal lead here in this third period. What's the strategy now in your mind, Coach? I don't think you change at all. I, I also don't know in today's game how you defend or be conservative. You're just inviting trouble to do that. Columbus has it in the defensive end. Puck battle along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Moves it over to Atkinson. Nice poke check. Manages to hang on. Stones him in front. The Flyers scoop it up along the boards. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Drills him. Feeds the puck to Wierenski. Pass back to the point. Denies him in front. High quality chance, high quality save. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looks like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Philadelphia's got the momentum with a one-goal lead. They'd love to add to that. Taken by Gustafson. Lifts the stick and takes the puck. Simple glove save by Hart. But he came out and challenged a good save. Let's get another look at that hit. This becomes a dead end in a hurry. Watch how he lays the shoulder. Right there, that's a big hit. Play set to resume with the face-off ready to go. Columbus wins the draw. Here's a short pass to Robinson. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck. Quick pass to Gustafson. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. From in close! Oh, what a save with the stick by Corpusalo! And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Jabs the puck away. Picked up along the wall by Savard. Scores! And they get it back! Now back to level square. You want them to be as aggressive as possible. You've got the other team reeling a little bit. Now coaches talk about getting to the front of the net, make it difficult on the goalie, take his eyes away. Man, he only could see the player's butts in front of him. He can't even see the puck. Columbus has found a way to even things up here in the back half of this third period. Continual work is the way to get it done, but they didn't get frustrated. They kept pushing ahead. Now they hope to find the winner in the last half of the period. Moves it to Bjorkstrand. Oh, he comes up with a stop as he got the glove on it. Takes the puck along the boards. Back to the blue line. Here's a shot. Nothing. Grabbed along the boards by Bjorkstrand. Let's one go, and there's the save. Hart's got the puck, and he'll hang on for the whistle. Well, in a close game, you've got to be in control of things, and he's had an excellent night so far. That's a dangerous scoring chance, but the goaltender makes a great save as he's able to snuff it out. Past the midway mark in this period, we got a tie game. Back underway, and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And that goes off a player. Scooped up along the wall by Jenner. Sends the pass over. There's the whistle stopping play. Penalty coming up here. And he's off to the box for two for tripping. Not much of an argument there. A stick between the player's feet. The Blue Jackets once again send out their power play unit. They're not going to get it done, James, the way they've been going about it. Until they get people in front of the net and bang away at a rebound, it's not going to happen. The Blue Jackets move it in. Here's the shot, and that one's stopped. On the rebound! Oh, and another big stop! Quick work. He makes one and two saves in a row. Takes the feed. Too many bodies in the way. Nice play shorthanded as they get control of the puck. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Columbus takes possession along the wall. 
Philadelphia's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Uses the force on that hit. Quick pass across to Roslevic. Takes that pass back at the point. Puck grabbed by Provorov. The Flyers get back to even strength after a huge effort by their penalty killers. Oh, the power play will wrap up, and they miss with a chance to score a really important power play goal. Bronze injury clearly is a leg injury, lower body. You see him hopping down the tunnel towards the locker room to get some treatment. We'll try to get an update from the media relations department here shortly. Now a quick pass to Provorov. Nice zone entry from the left. The Blue Jackets gain possession in their own end. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. Here's a chance. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Picked up along the boards by Roslevic. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Fires it. Oh, what a big time stop by Hart. Slides it across to Lindblom. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Battling for it along the boards. Taken along the wall by Domi. Puts him hard into the wall. Takes the pass. Bjorkstrand's got it against the boards. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Giroux's moving the puck through his own zone. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Quick feed to Bjorkstrand. Takes it to the net. Here he is, shot right in front. Answered the call there. Yeah, it's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. Big play inside the defensive zone. Puts it on net. That's blocked. Picked up along the wall by Giroux. And that's broken up. He carries the puck up along the wing. Strong defensive effort. Gavrikov's got it into offensive territory. Right to the middle. And that one's blocked. Stick save and a butte by Hart. He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. The Flyers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Regulation time comes to an end. That means we've got some overtime coming up. Join our fan club and receive a membership card. Discounts on team merchandise and team ringtones, as well as email notifications on upcoming... We'll take a quick break. OT, next. short their player who was injured earlier will not be back tonight thanks very much for the update ray overtime action is underway absolutely love it here's the chance oh what a save to keep it tied as a great older colleague of mine says this is waffle boarded away a lot on the line here in this offensive zone faceoff. Philadelphia's won the faceoff. Here he is in front, and he's able to handle that one. A critical draw here. The Flyers win it. Puck picked up by Provorov. Denies that opportunity. Corpusalo's job is not just to stop the puck, but get it out of danger. He does that here. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Domi's won a big draw on their own end. Nice zone entry from the right side. 
That pass doesn't go. The Flyers gain control of the puck against the wall. Moves inside! Nice defensive robbery with the stick. And he puts that one aside with ease. Great poke check on the reach. And the puck's back on his blade here at center. Moves it quickly over to Jones. That goes wide. And now he moves it quickly to Giroux. Makes his presence known on the ice. Columbus gets the puck near the boards. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Strong defensive effort. Hangs onto the puck. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Game on a stick! Oh, we are still tied! What a stop! Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Tried to get 2Q with it and loses possession. Konechny's in good position to create a scoring chance, but he bobbles the puck and the chance is gone. Wrist shot from the slot. Turns it away. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Here comes the pushback. Grovorov's ready to go. Apparently, the other guy doesn't want anything to do with him. Well, it looks like the trainer's going to meet him at the door here. He's struggling to get off the ice, just trying to get to the bench. Nice zone entry from the middle. For the win! And it comes up with a huge save! Hey, James, we got to get another look at that. He's pretty rattled here. Looks like he took a pretty big hit. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Columbus takes possession off the draw. Slides the puck across to Atkinson. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Cuts to the front. Huge stop by Hart. Puck scooped up by Voracek. Gaining momentum up along the side. Move to the middle. Looking to end it. And he misses. We're still tied. Here's a short pass to Voracek. For the win. Oh, and he missed. Maintains possession. Quick pass to Sanheim. Gives them nothing in front. Columbus has possession of it now. There's the horn, and we are off to a shootout. Coach is submitting their list. The shootout is coming up next. Well, here we go. The moment of truth for both sides here. Overtime solves nothing. We go to the shootout. It's hockey's equivalent of high noon. The shootout is set to go. Makes it look easy on the play there, Ray. I think it's harder for the goalie in the shootout than it would be on a breakaway. The shooter has so much more time. Drews at center ice with the mindset, anything you can do, I can do better. Absolutely nothing doing on that. Sometimes you make a move, sometimes you choose to shoot, and there's just nothing there. Next shooter for Columbus, number 16, Max Dillon. He's dialed in on that one. So quick across the net, doesn't matter if you deke or shoot on him, he's really good at this. can open the scoring here in this shootout here on the back half of round number two. Oh, tried to pick his corner and puts it off the outside of the post. This has been all goalies so far here in this shootout. Still no goals, but here we go. Round number three. Let's see if things change. Chips if he can finish it. He scores! And what's the old expression? Winner, winner! Chicken dinner. Great shot. A winner, winner, gluten-free, vegan-friendly dinner, I guess, in this case here. Oh, the shootout is relatively new, and they get nothing done in regulation, but they put it away here in the extra shootout.
I guess there's a lot of different organizations that can take credit for how this grassroots movement started, but I love the post-game tip of the cap here. Well, I think any team that doesn't do it now would look like they're missing the boat. For Ray Ferraro, I'm James Sabalski. We'll see you next time we drop the puck.